everyone. This is Michelle. Lesson eighteen, the original version of the Entertainer. If you are looking for easy version tutorial, please check lesson seventeen. The Entertainer was composed by American contemporary composer Scott Joplin, who sought to elevate ragtime to a serious art form. Ragtime is a precursor to jazz. Joplin wrote forty-four ragtime pieces. Scott Joplin, king of ragtime. The work is in sectional form with four strings, each repeated as A, A, B, B, A, C, C, D, D. The rhythm is march-like, with syncopated rhythms in the right hand. And a steady beat in the left hand. The entertainer was used in the 1973 classic, The Sting. Let's talk about the details of Scott Joplin, the entertainer, original version.、Uh, the music starts with the intro. Then the musical form is in A A B B. And in C that modulates to F major, and that's repeated too. And then D, D, and to finish. Ragtime is a musical form with syncopated melody, usually in two-four time signature, over a regular march bass. And the、uh, intro here says、uh, not fast. And start with the forte it means、uh, loud, and then、uh, toward the end of that intro there is a, a dominant G. This is in C major, and then into the、uh, dominant, and it was a two-four time signature,、uh, two beats in each measure.、And、then the melody starts from、uh, an acrusis that is a pickup, then to the downbeat. And、then、uh, here we have、uh, this one syncopation, that one syncopation, and that one the C, the C. There are one, two, three, three Cs. This C is not a syncopation because it's on the beat, and the、uh, syncopation means irregular beats.、Uh, when you have weak to the strong、uh, tie notes,、uh, weak to the strong、uh, the tie notes, that's irregular beats. That's called syncopation. And when you practice,、uh, I would suggest that you do your left hand first, and then right hand.、Uh, left hand here, you have a jump that、uh, bouncing back and forth. It's not easy to get the accuracy. So practice alone to get the accuracy, and then free yourself to、uh, stay. Uh, keep your eyes on music and work on the、uh, the intervals. Like this is、uh, not as easy because、uh, you not only need to play octave, you also have、uh, the third notes in the middle there that you need to use your second fingers to play. And so it's very easy bump into wrong notes, and、uh, with lots of practice, it will work. And、um, I circle some of the interest in the bass,、uh, that you can bring it out a little bit. And the dynamics level is always、uh, piano forte, piano forte, piano forte. The lower end of the melody with piano, and then higher end register so with a forte. And uh, uh, left hand you want it because it's、uh, going back and forth. You want to detach that. There is no way to play smoothly connected. And so some of the interest when you have, for example, chromatic descending or sound like a scale ascending that you can show a little bit. And this one is interesting too. So it's a descending a line there that you can bring it with your syncopated melody. And in the、uh, section B here. Uh, suggested that when you repeat, you can play on one octave higher, and that、uh, one octave higher sign ends here, and then you go back to the regular 
uh, position to play. You wanted to keep a good balance by bringing out right hand more than your left hand. Remember that your left hand has this uh, downbeat, steady beat. But you don't want it to uh, overpower your right hand. Make sure your right hand has the melody. And like this one here, chromatic descending there, descending to C, and that sounds good. So bring out a little bit. And in the uh, end of the section B here, you have. It's a happy chords there, so try to bring out a little bit. And in the um, page three and page four here, uh, you have a, a short moment. Go back to the section A. Uh, so that is A A B B A, and then modulate to C C, and then D D. In section D at the end. You have left hand's octave going Sounds a very interesting melody going on there to go with your right syncopated melody and will make this music very interesting uh, to wrap up. And uh, the music here is not easy to do, but then with lots of practice, uh, persistency is the word, and you are going to get it and enjoy the entertainer.